And welcome back. Some young aspiring actors share their talents in a special benefit performance this weekend at the Rivertown Theaters. It's called Raise Your Voice 2. It will bring some of your favorite pop and musical theater hits together on one stage. We're joined by director Tess Fushi and Susan O'Quinn of the O'Quinn Foundation for details on the show and how it benefits. We're going to get that information for you now. But uh, so I look at you, Tess, and I say, okay, you're a high school student, but you're a director as well. Yes. How did that come to be? Well, um, I was in a charity concert about the same thing when I was about 12, and um, I really loved the way it made me feel because I love performing, and so why not share my talents to benefit a charity? Right. So I got all of my friends together, and we um, just are creating this concert to benefit a wonderful local charity. So it's called uh, Raise Your Voice 2. Yes. And um, tell us a little about that, then we'll talk about the actual foundation. So it's a very high energy um, musical theater review of lots of show stopping numbers from musicals like Singing in the Rain and Something Rotten, Matilda, Bonnie and Clyde. Um, it's about an hour and um, all of the kids that are in it are from around the city and they've starred in lots of local productions at Tulane, Summer Lyric and Rivertown Theaters, JPAS and um, they're the best of the best of, <laughs> of my friends. So it's really great to have them all with me. You know, it sounds to me like this is a great excuse to get all your friends together, to have almost a party, have fun, do what you do best, but also for a, a great cause. Exactly. Let's bring in Susan O'Quinn. Now, Susan, this foundation, tell us a little about the foundation that's going to be benefiting. It was founded in honor of my son who was born with a congenital heart defect, and so we started the foundation a few years back. We have fundraisers throughout the year, and we donate money to families through grants. Um, that they apply for to help them defray their medical costs, ho you know, hospital, hotel, lodging, all that, food, mileage. How did this come together with you and Tess saying, all right, I want to get my friends together. We're going to have fun, but we're going to raise money at the same time, and then to actually benefit the Oakland Foundation. How did that all come to be? Uh, well, I wanted to support a local charity, and one of our performers, Harley, actually has the same one of the same conditions. Um, so she wasn't really um, part of the foundation because it wasn't founded when she had her heart surgery. But um, I wanted to support something local, and my aunt is on the board of the uh, foundation, so I thought it would be the perfect charity to support. That's amazing. I mean, that's the, you know, you guys are having fun. Uh, so d you directed this as well. You put this all together, the choreography, everything. Yes, everything. I've been organizing and running rehearsals. You know, printing sheet music, choreographing numbers, um, cleaning everything so it'll turn out perfect. Right. Well, I have to little uh, give a little secret. Aid. Tess, their family owns the Rivertown uh, Theater. So she's been in this for a while. So you're taking that energy and bringing it to a great cause. So Susan, um, tell us again a little more about that foundation. It does help a lot of uh, families that have, you know, the issues that you had. And um, just tell us a little more about that. So um, when my son was first diagnosed, I was still pregnant. But when he was born, he was transferred to Children's, and he was in the hospital for 78 days. And he wasn't in long, nearly as long as many people are. Wow. Um, so I, I was no longer working. You have food expenses, but we're local, so we didn't have the lodging expenses and things like that. But many people come from all over the state, some from Texas, Mississippi. Sure. So we give out money to try to help them with their financial burden. Some parents have to miss work, lose their jobs. You know, they're living in the Ronald McDonald House or a local hotel, running the house, eating in the hospital for all their meals. So we it, try to do as much as we can to help. I mean, it's a bad enough time that, you know, your child is sick, much less having to worry about expenses. Correct. So this really comes in handy for that. So uh, one more time, Tess, tell us the time and date. It's this Sunday at Rivertown Theaters at 1.30 p.m. Okay. There you have the information there, and uh, you can go online and check, out, uh, check that out. Rivertown Theaters tickets are 20 bucks, and again, all proceeds go to the Oakland Foundation. Tess, you're a very talented young lady. Keep it Thank up. Thank you. All righty. Thanks Thank a lot, you. Susan. Thanks Good for luck having to you guys. Us. All righty. Well,